let's go. Detroit Ballin', it's part of the culture. It's a deep base, the trade you in the poster. You know the facts, so while we test the roaster. Killing your haze, deadly handles our exposure, cool composure. Team stack to win the chip, act like I ain't told you. First round. What is good, everybody? It's your boy Piston. Mike, make sure you like, share, comment, and subscribe. Hit that notification bell button because it don't cost you anything. Not even a what? Nickel or a dime. Let's get into today's video. Before you do that, you know, make sure you don't skip the ads for your boy. Shout out to Alex. Keeping me updated. Go subscribe to Piston Weebly Report. But let's get into today's video, man. Piston fans, y'all might have to wait one more season because we one player away from being greatness. Now, what you might say, why are you saying that, Piston Mike? Okay. This team don't have another top end talent, bro. We need another superstar. Now, I get it. Jaden Ivey, don't get me wrong. He could be a star, maybe a superstar, but we still need one more, man. We still need one more. The NBA is deep, man. Deep with stars, deep with players. But it's better when you draft your own stars, your own superstars, man. We need just one more guy. Look, Bay is really good, a really good piece, a really good third or four option. Let's be real on the team. Kate is the number one guy. Now we got his 1A and Jaden Ivey. Cool. Jalen Duran looks like he's going to be a really nice piece. but but And so is Livers. So is Bagley. So is Stewart. But besides Cade and Ivy, who else is somebody on this team that can really go get their own bucket? I get it. Sadiq Bay can really go do it. But nobody else besides them three. And we need to go get another guy. We're young we're going to struggle this year, but by next year, I believe this team will be put it together. That's when I definitely think we'll be making the playoffs. That's when I definitely think Troy Weaver is going to spend his money on quality free agents to come to Detroit. Yes, this will be another tanking year. This draft is absolutely going to be bonkers. Like, it's going to be way better than last year's draft. Absolutely. Without a doubt. And not only that, we owe our 2024 pick to New York. So realistically, this is the only draft we have left. And Pete, we need more high-end talent. And that's just what it is. Might not like what I said, but it's true. It's true. <laughs> Look. We had another player like Cam Whitmore. Do you understand me? Cam Whitmore is about to be a beast. Add another player like G.G. Jackson. A three or a four. I mean, even a more realistically, somebody who can play the four. I, I, I like... Isaiah Stewart, and I like, I really do like Marvin Bagley, but I think them are bench guys, bro. I don't think neither one of them going to be a starting four. They got to prove me wrong, but I don't think so, man. The four is an extension to the three, and they got a whole bunch of good wings in this next draft. Ain't nothing but wing heaven. Like I said, G.G. Jackson, Cam Whitmore. You got Dariq Whitehead. You got Dylan Mitchell. You got Chris Livingston. You have um, players like returning like Terrence Sandin Jr. Um, Maxwell Lewis from Pepperdine. You just got so many of them. So, so many. Um, so many of them, bro. So... That's my opinion on it. Pistons fans. Just wait one more year. I promise it's going to be worth it because the vision is crazy. You guys let me know. 
if I'm wrong or right for making this video. Uh, you guys let me know. Go get your nickel, not even a nickel or a dime. Shirts and the t-shirts and the link in the description. Shout out to Alice for always keeping me updated. You know me, I got to get this work in. And don't skip the mask. I'm out. Peace. They all jumping in, pissing mic, we take your flight, click like and subscribe, we can keep you right. Yeah, it's pissing mic.